Hello friends, it's the Crunchy Mama. Here we are looking at Queen Anne's Lace or Wild Carrot, which looks similar to a very poisonous plant, Poison Hemlock. But we can tell that this is a wild carrot by several features. One of the first features is that it has a hairy stem, whereas poison hemlock has a blotchy stem with purple splotches and streaks all down it. Um, another identifying feature is the purple flower in the center of the umbral. Now this is not always there, so um, just have to be careful about that I guess. Um, here is one of the umbrals going to see that it's making it's closing up. It looks kind of like a bird's nest. And um, oh, we have a little bug who's made a home in there. <laughs> Anyways, that is going to seed. And then we can take a look at the leaves. Okay, we can see from the leaf stalks how uh, the leaflets are coming out. Okay. Now I highly suggest that you study poison hemlock. I don't have any poison hemlock to show you, so um, definitely want to study that before you try to uh, eat any wild carrot to make sure that you don't die from eating poison hemlock. But another very important um, way to find out if it is. Um, if it is wild carrot is to take a piece of the plant but first make sure it has a hairy stem and no red splotches because to me that that is the best way to find out almost I would say a foolproof way but if you take a part of the plant and you crush it all parts of the plant are going to smell like wild or like carrot and this smells like a carrot so Hairy stem. It's got the purple little flower in the center. If it happens to have a bird's nest, uh, because the poison hemlock doesn't do this. Of course, I think that the purple flower and the bird's nest feature are uh, not surefire ways, in my opinion. It, it, the two surefire ways are the hairy stem and the smell of carrots in all parts of the plant. All right, I hope that's been helpful to you. Oh, one more thing, and this is a biennial plant, which means it has a two year growth season. <clears throat> and so when you see the flowers, the umbrals, uh, it means that it's in its second year, which means that the root that we, that is what we would call a carrot, is actually past its prime and is not good to eat. Um, Susan Weed, in one of her videos that I've seen, says that you can actually eat um, the, uh, the umbrals in salad, and I believe Sam Thayer said in his book um, that the, if you peel the stems, that they are good too. I'll have to double check that, and I'll make a comment in the comment section. But um, once you get really familiar with identifying um, the the leaf structure, then uh, you can look for um, first season, first year plants to dig up that the root that we would, that our carrots that we think of uh, buying from the grocery store are very similar to. All right, so everybody have a great day, and uh, we'll see you next time.